Hey guys, what's up? My name is Brie and welcome to my channel. Okay, so quick little intro. As you can tell by the title of this video, it is moving day. I am moving into my new apartment today. I'm a little stressed. I've been at work all day and now I'm kind of gonna rushing over from work to the new complex. My car is all packed. Cole's car is packed. We are gonna leave and head over there, but the leasing office closes at 5.30. It's currently like 4.30 and I really hope traffic isn't too bad getting over there because it's probably like at least 20 minutes away, but they've been calling me all day asking where I am, so I'm just a little stressed, but I'm gonna head over there and hopefully everything just works out and I'll update you then. All right, I got the keys. Oh, I'm so excited. I literally already love this complex because they are 10 times better than my old one as far as like staff wise and just overall vibe. They're so helpful here and we're just so friendly and like kind and I'm just so excited. So I've got the keys. I'm at the, the building. I'm just waiting for Cole to get here because you want to me to wait for him so he's, he should be here like any minute now but I'm really excited and I just can't wait to move things in I was a little nervous because um, my next bath fit fun box arrived here yesterday um, it came a lot quicker than I thought it would um, so I obviously wasn't moved in yesterday and they left it outside my door and I saw the picture of it but then I had Cole come over here just to try and grab it just so I no one could steal it and he said nothing was out there so I was really worried that um, like someone had grabbed it um, but they said that usually like maintenance or housekeeping um, kind of takes packages and just puts them inside so it should be inside which I'm hoping there's Cole now <laughs> so I'm excited hopefully it's in there and stop and let's go move some stuff in oh my box is here thank god oh kicked it I didn't see it Yeah. It's opposite of the unit. Well, yeah, because the other one was on the opposite side of the building, I think. Oh, I got the box. Thank God. It's mine. Yay! Hey. <laughs> oh, I'm in the bedroom. I ended up with a flake. Nice. Cool. Now that's a view. <laughs> I don't know the light is. Oh, it's over here. Over It's so big! <laughs> Look at all this kid on your face I have. Please, double door with my washer and dryer! I really like the color of the cabinets. Wait. Aw, oh, I thought they're soft clothes. Oh, the balcony! Yes. She's so big. Unlock it. Oh. Oh. Screen, too. Nice. So much space. Oh, my plants have so much space to breathe. <laughs> How excited I am. Just a little bit. I really do like the view though. Oh. Oh, nice. How's it going? How's it coming? Oh, good. I'm getting stuff organized. It's a mess out here. It's an organized mess. I'm not talking about you. I never talk about Hi. You having fun? You're so pretty. <laughs> okay, so we have moved in all the stuff for day one out of our cars. Not everything is like organized in its place, but it's basically in there. So we're gonna take a little stroll, I think stop by the mail area and just check on that situation. And then we gotta get something to eat and I need to go grocery shopping today. So we got a lot left to do, but overall very productive day most of my stuff is in here i'm just gonna get some like the rest of like the little stuff tomorrow um by myself and then 
Um, we're doing like the big furniture on Monday, so we still got some time until I'm like fully moved in. But even the big furniture, like we really don't, I really don't have that much stuff. So like it really shouldn't take that long. And our friend Brandon is gonna help us um, move some of this stuff on Monday. So hopefully it'll go well, but I think that's, we'll see what else we do today if I film anything else, but. Okay, it is a lot later now. Um, we did not bring the camera with us out to get food we just went to chipotle and i don't know what the heck chipotle is putting in their hot salsa now but it freaking killed me she turned into a freaking chihuahua i was, was literally i was trying to like eat ice to cool my mouth down be it i was freezing and shivering from eating the ice and i always get that hot salsa and it's like hot but it's not like terrible like that so i'm i don't i don't know i don't know what to do about that and then we were gonna do a bunch of grocery shopping at Target, but then it got really late. It was almost like 9.30, so we weren't gonna have a lot of time. So I basically just got something to have for lunch tomorrow, and then I'll go shopping after work tomorrow. Um, I have to go back to my old place and pack up all the rest of the little stuff and bring it here, and then I'll go grocery shopping while Cole is at work and um, just kinda get stuff done around here. But I got some packages that arrived, so I've got some stuff to put together. That is super exciting, and we're basically back now. We're just gonna do some little things and then um, we're gonna head to his place and just stay there for tonight. But um, yeah, I will check back in with you guys tomorrow for the rest of the movie vlog. Hey guys, so it is the next day. It is Saturday. I just got done from work, came home, got changed. This is, I'm in my old apartment. Um, I'm now gonna take a bunch of my like, basically the rest of the small stuff that is not like big furniture to my new apartment and move that in, unbox it, like do all that stuff. That's kind of my goal for today. And then I need to go grocery shopping. So that is also the goal. Um, I have other stuff I can like start building and putting together, but that's kind of like on the back burner because I really just need to get those two things done today. Um, I really don't have that much stuff here to put in my car. I'm hoping it's all gonna fit in one trip because I'm really not taking two trips. Um, but let me show you what I recently have left. So I know this is like a hodgepodge of a lot of different things, but I've got just like a bunch of random bags and things that I just like couldn't fit in the first trip with me and Cole. And then I've got like some random things in here and I gotta pack up all of my clothes. I'm gonna put those in like, put garbage bags around a bunch of them and just kind of like put them in my car so I don't have to really fold anything. And then I'd really love to be able to take the drawers off of my dresser and just put them in the car. So that come like Monday when we're moving all the furniture, like the dresser isn't as heavy um, and the clothes are already like in the new units. So that's kind of the goal. I also have my plants outside. I have like six or seven plants that are in little pots. They're not that big, but I just, I can't just like throw them places. Like I need to have them like on the floor of my car or somewhere where I know they're not going to topple over. So I'd really love to be able to bring them in this trip just to get them over there because I want to be able to water them frequently. And I, I don't know. I just I would love to get them over today. So we're going to see what happens. Um, I will update you when I'm getting ready to leave, but I got to try and get all this stuff in my car. Okay guys, I did it. It's 6.30 now, I got the car all packed up. So as you can see behind me, I got my plants down there, down there. I've got the trunk like completely filled. The only thing I was not able to get, which I realized now as I was about to leave, is that all the drawers of my dresser, I wasn't able to get all of those clothes out, which isn't the worst thing. I grabbed what I needed um, until I'll be here next. Um, so it's not the biggest deal, because I can always do that. Bring those on Monday when I bring the rest of the dresser um, here. I have a feeling we're gonna have a lot of space in the U-Haul, um, so it's really not a big deal. But I'm gonna bring all this up to my new unit and bring it at least inside. I get my plants out on the balcony and then I can go grocery shopping and start getting this stuff done. Okay, I wanted to take a little break to see dinner. I moved my plants and like all my perishable food in, so that was like most important to get in right away. But you know what? Nothing really says welcome to your new home like eating leftover Chipotle on your porch overlooking the pool. It's very foggy. <laughs> it's so humid in Florida. But literally, I really like it here and I'm really excited to 
get everything in here for the next couple days. Okay, so I made it to Target. It's 8.50 now and Target closes at 10. So I really need to hustle and get in and get out. So I'll see you later. All right, almost exactly an hour later, I made it out of Target on time. And I feel like I got a lot of freaking stuff. And I really didn't spend as much as I thought I was going to. So kudos to me and kudos to the Target Circle app and kudos to the coupons I found yesterday in my mailbox. So I'm gonna head back, put away these groceries, make myself like a type of a lunch to bring to work tomorrow. Um, and hopefully Cole will get off work soon because he's gonna pick me up and um, bring me over to his apartment. But um, yeah, it's been a long day and I really feel like I haven't done that much, but I'm exhausted. And worst case, I can stall some time and just hang out at the apartment. But let's go. Hello everyone, it is day three of moving. Um, so me and Cole just got back from work um, and we are going to start putting together my bar stools because they came. I have four new bar stools that I got off Amazon. Um, so they just arrived today. So we gotta put all four of them together because we literally have nowhere to sit in this apartment. Uh, because we don't move the rest of the furniture in until tomorrow. Um, I don't think it should be that hard, but we got to put them together and then we can make dinner tonight. Um, but yeah, well, let's go put the furniture together. Okay, so we finally finished with the chairs, kind of. We got three out of the four built, but the one we realized was the holes were drilled wrong, so you literally can't complete it. So I gotta fill out some form to uh, get a new part sent to me, whatever. But I mean, we got three down, so the bare minimum we needed was two. So it's not the biggest deal, but I think I'm gonna make some dinner soon and then We'll probably just like hang out or just do whatever here for a little bit. We aren't going to do too much more today, but tomorrow is going to be the big day of moving everything. So I will catch up with you guys tomorrow. Good morning, everyone. It is finally moving day. Moving the big furniture today. And we said the last day I'm ever going to see this old apartment ever again. Aww. I'm not very sad about it. But. Me and Cole are on our way to the U-Haul place. So we were gonna get Duncan before we got to the U-Haul, but we got <clears> off to a little late of a start, so we're gonna grab it on the way back. Um, and then, basically we just gotta start loading stuff up. Brandon is gonna meet us at my old unit, um, probably around 11, 11.30, so that should be good timing to get things done then. And we're just gonna get the ball rolling. All right, Duncan is secured. And now, I don't know if Brandon's here, but let's get moving, I'm ready. All right, let the games begin because Brandon has arrived. <laughs> Are you excited to move stuff, Brandon? Super excited. <laughs> it's gonna be such a good day.
for the TV that we gotta bring there. But we are gonna head to the new place and unload it all there. Can you, what are you doing? Gotta keep my pants up. So, sick. so you this tied is, this uh, is a. Only for you and Brandon sometimes, but. So what did you tie around your waist? Ratchet strap. Gotta keep this ratchet strap. Oh, okay, <laughs> we're, <laughs> we're we're done here. All right, we have everything moved in and did it in a timely manner. I think everything looks really great. We've obviously got a lot of stuff to kind of move around or finish putting together and all that type of stuff. And I've got some furniture coming next week, but it looks really great and I'm super excited, but I will not be showing you right now. That is a different vlog once the apartment is fully finished. So expect that in maybe like a month or so. Oh man, why not? <laughs> I wanna see it. I wanna see it too. Too bad. Yeah. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching. As always, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below to stay up to date on my latest content. You can also follow me on Instagram at bgraph100 to stay up to date on my content there or TikTok at the same name. And I will see you guys next week, Thursday at 6 p.m. Bye.